Hello guys, today I will do a quick review of this AAG Feon hair blower. The model for this is H25684. And here is the box and uh, on the box it said it's professional hair dryer and it comes with ion technology function, that's rather good. I tend to buy these ones, but more or less uh, not a big deal, probably just helps a little bit with static and everything like that, something. And it has a 2200 watts, what's rather nice, so it has some power there. Cool shot, three temperature power settings and two speed settings and as well as you can see a little bit there it says that you can actually fold this one so you can carry it with you somewhere else where you go the price for this one was around 30 dollars or something like that but probably you can get cheaper here is a little bit specification about this one and it says it's a minimum 1800 watts so well you never know and as well uh, it is some sort of these extras like hanging loop Overheating protection, what's rather good, and then many other things you can read by yourself. And in box you also get this little piece, but I don't use it, so. And of course you also get the manual, if you want you can read it, but I will not do it. So the hair dryer by itself looks like this, rather nice, it has a rather smooth surface, uh, it's kind of rubberish and something like that, what's rather good. As well it has some of these silver elements, but overall it's from the plastic as you see. And then it has also removable filter there if you sometimes need to do it there are some dials for speeds as you see they kind of already faded out after three months of using but this is not a big deal and here you can adjust the speeds and here is like this cool air blow and there is some more information on top of here i don't know if you need to know it or not but anyway it's certified and it comes also with a nice thick wire what's rather good sign So speaking a little bit more about what you get in the box, here is also technical specification. So in, in the specification, as you see, this says it's protection class number two and it weighs around 600 grams. And speaking about the cable, well, as you see the cable there, you can, it's a little bit over one, one meter 80, so something like that. It's a rather nice length, enough for uh, just using for regular use, so that's good. Also, you can fold this one as you see on the box. Well, let's do this one. To do it, you just have to twist this one, the back of the. And you don't have to put any button, and it just locks into place. And as you see, it kind of gives a little bit more space for you, so you can put some other things there too. And it's also really easy to untwist it. And it's here and working really well. You can twist it just one way, so just so you know. Well, I wanted also to do a few tests, like uh, how low this is and uh, how much heat you can get out of this one. So let's just try out and see how loud this one is. As you see, when I'm talking, it's already about 60 decibels or something like that, even up to that. Depends on how loud I speak. And let's see how loud this is. I will just put this rather, that's, that's kind of, uh, this is rather close, I know. But anyway, it kind of will give you a little preview with the first speed level. Second speed level. So if you are rather nice, so this should be probably the distance away how when you are blowing your hairs with second speed and with the first speed a little bit farther away from the blower itself this was a quick test how loud this is and then you could see the decibels by yourself if you turn on the heat it doesn't change the loudness so let's do a little temperature test I will use just regular food thermometer so I hope I will not break it otherwise someone will be angry to me <laughs> As you see, the temperature inside is right around 80 degrees. Right now, I'll just blow the cold air on top of it. Yeah, it kind of just come warmed out from the, the engine. Let's turn on the first heat level. Mm -hmm. 
let's increase to the second uh, heat level. No, I put really close this one. So maximum around 74 degrees. Let's put uh, speed level one with uh, heat level two. Really closely, I put this one right now. Not like when you're blowing your hairs. And let's put a really cold shot there and see how much. How fast this will actually decrease the temperature for this metal rod. So this was a little heat test as you see, and probably it's not the most accurate but kinda gave you the picture. Overall I'm really happy with this one, about the price and about the quality and the looks, it is rather useful and, and, and I've been using it for three months and uh, not just alone so it is also durable it's felt a few times there and here and then and overall I'm really happy and if you're looking for a hairdryer maybe this is for you decided maybe you like have it look or something else so it's up to you thanks for watching and I hope I could at least give you some preview what you can expect from this AAG professional hairdryer H25684 model and uh, goodbye